Ole Gunnar Solskjaer's first game as Manchester United's permanent manager has ended with a win. And you've got to be happy about that. But for me, that was quite a concerning performance. Yes, there was three points, 2-1 winners against Watford. But we let them control so much of that game. We had a non-existent midfield today of Pogba, Matic and Herrera. And while our last-ditch defending from Smalling and Jones was brilliant, there was far too much of it. And that was because of the lack of midfield today. I can't believe how poor Pogba, Matic and Herrera were. Because every time we came out of defence, there was no midfield. Watford won the ball back early and they pressed. They had, what, they had like 18 chances or something like that to United's five or six. They had so many more. Luckily, we had Marcus Rashford up front, who today again showed the major side I feel that's improved in his game under Solskjaer, and that's his clinical finishing. Because Rashford did not have many opportunities today. But when Shaw put that ball through to him, Rashford dinked it over the onrushing Ben Foster, made it 1-0 United. And at that point, we didn't really deserve it. But it's a mark of a good team. We always know that. It's a mark of a good team when you're not playing well, if you can still win. And I would definitely count that game against Watford as a poor performance over the 90 minutes. But let me know what you think about that in the comments below. And as I said, I want to talk about the midfield and the defence because... The defence today, if you're looking at Phil Jones and Chris Smalling in terms of them stopping Watford, they were very good. But a modern day centre-back has to be somebody more than just somebody who's going to tackle or win headers. They have to be confident enough with the ball at their feet to play out from the back. That's what a modern day great centre-back needs to be. And that is what Jones and Smalling will never, ever, ever be able to do at Man United. So while I'm not going to be critical of the fact that I felt their last ditch defending was very good, I felt they got themselves in a lot of bother with how they were playing out from the back with the ball. But yes, United's midfield made that 10 times worse because Matic was just shit. Pogba was woeful. Herrera was, I'm not surprised he got taken off. None of them were really showing themselves as an option for Smalling and Jones to pass to. And because of that, Watford found it very easy to press against us and win the ball back early. And of course, with Ashley Young being there, the less that he said about Ashley Young, the better. I love the guy, consummate professional, but come on, man. You're not going to win the Premier League or the Champions League with Ashley Young at right back. End of discussion. Thought Luke Shaw, again, fantastic today. Really, really was. That assist was mustard. And United hitting on the counter-attack again under Solskjaer. Louis van Gaal called it, Part the bus football, but that wasn't. That was just a very good counter-attack from United. And I'm, as I said, you've got to be happy because it's the international break. You come back, United went into the international break in a bit of a slump, didn't we? After Watford, after Arsenal, question marks. Not question marks, major question marks, but just, I suppose, concerns. And that's slightly been buried by beating Watford. But with Barcelona coming up, United... Can't play like that against Barcelona. We'll get ripped to shreds. Because Watford, while they were very good today, they just fell at the final hurdle every single time. Their final pass was woeful. And that allowed United to stay strong. And I'm not surprised that we actually conceded because I, was, I would have been more surprised if we kept a clean sheet. So Watford deserved that goal and arguably deserved more. But United were clinical. Martial came up with the second goal there. Again, Rashford really crucially involved in that goal. But I'm worried about how bad United's midfield was. Matic, as I've said, has to go in the summer. He's not fit for this system that Solskjaer is trying to build into this United team. He just doesn't suit it. And Paul Pogba, what was that? Come on. You've got to be dominating a game like this. You've got to be dominating at Old Trafford. We're so much better, it seems, away from home than we are at Old Trafford, which is a bit weird. But let me know what you think about that. Three points... You've got to be happy with that. International break's over. Everyone's back. Three points on the board. But United did not play well today. And it would not have been a surprise had Watford scored a late equaliser. It was that sort of performance. But Solskjaer will be happy. He'll be mainly happy with his defence. But there's a big question mark over our midfield there. And as I said, our defence's ability to play out from the back with the ball. Today, we saw that 
is a major issue that needs to be solved in the summer. But let me know what you think about the match in the comments below, as always. And if you're new to United People's TV, make sure you subscribe. Until next time, though, take it easy. Oh, and we hit 100,000. Come on!